had fantastic weather on our um, five day travels around the lower North Island and um, the main reason for our adventure was to travel up to Taumaranui to do the um, Forgotten World Adventures rail tri trip and uh, it was a fantastic trip. So the first part of the journey where we stayed the night was from home to Wanganui. So the, the day started out beautiful and as I said so did the rest of the uh, weather. It was so fine the whole trip. Down the hill and onto the uh, State Highway 2. Down the new, the new um, road heading north. Got stuck in tra traffic of Otaki as per usual. It's usually coming south, but this time it's heading north and uh, went down the, uh, the side of it. All the traffic and got through pretty quickly. The first stop was in Bulls. Where we had a coffee and uh, we had a bite to eat, like a scone or something. Okay. Filled the bike up. Took a couple of piggies outside from inside. There we go. Then we headed from Bulls, short trip to Wanganui. And here's Wanganui, round the roundabout, instead of going straight ahead, that, like we do to the motorbike races, we turned right and headed to the Woods City Centre this way. And um, then towards our accommodation for the night, which was the Rutland Arms Hotel, the green building on the left. Uh, we went to uh, allowed to book in before three o'clock. They've got one lady that does all the rooms and she's been there for about a hundred years and she takes her time. Well, we arms, just waiting for the right time to get to the our room. Should be three o'clock. Yeah so we had a couple of drinks and uh, the next day we headed from uh, Wanganui through Ratahi where we stopped for a coffee to tell Maranui. So it's Ratahi there on the map yeah, and uh, yeah. pulled up before we left Wanganui and we went on over the old bridge there and um, headed out of Wanganui. Took a wrong turning which uh, we thought was River Road but no, there's a river down to your left. Got right to the end of that road and the farmer guy said, no, nah, you're on the wrong road. So here it is, the correct road. And man, what a road this is. Uh, the first hill we came to, that's straight off the main highway. You get to the top of this hill and the, the vista was absolutely stunning. It's very hard to capture on film. But took some photos, the wife and I took some photos so you can have a quick look at those. Um, the whole road itself is absolutely amazing. I could have put the video, the whole video on, but it would have taken about three hours. <laughs> so I had to cut it down. But uh, really fantastic scenery up here. It's the bike. And then, and then we took off along, along River Road, and the rest of the scenery you'll see for a few minutes is uh, along River Road. As I said, this road is awesome. It's definitely not a 100 kilometer an hour road, 
Um, very narrow, so you know, maximum you want to do is 80 kilometers an hour down here. Um, in a few parts I'll sped it up just so you can see some of the scenery, but uh, keep the video a bit shorter. There I am talking about the layers, sedimentary layers. Uh, used to be under the sea a few million years ago. You can still find fossil shells of uh, crabs and stuff. Yeah, they cut a beautiful road short. Here we are in Ratahi. Where we stop for the coffee. Interesting sights in Ratahi. Here's one of them. Angel Louise Kef. And a ginger beer. And from right here, we carried on to Tamara Nui. National Park. The road uh, center is not quite as uh, nice as the river road, but uh, still some nice, nice scenery to be had. Very little traffic. Obviously the whole journey is good, like you expect it to. So tourists that are indicated on for about five minutes, I thought I'd better pass them. This has sped up this section of road. It's quite a nice scenery there though. So I'll sped it up, just kept it in the video. Here we are on the outskirts of Tamaranui. We're on the main drag. It's 
some disused carriages over there to the right, falling to pieces. Here's the hotel, that digs for the night. Run by the same people that uh, run the uh, Forgotten World Adventure uh -huh. Rail Adventure. So, here's a couple of photos of the place. Pokey little place. <laughs> so there you go. Oh, cool, it's got one of those stupid shells. It's cool, it's got one of those stupid shells. I hate those shells. Mm -hmm. Wood of dribbles out, you gotta run around to get wet. Here we are outside the hotel room. Here we are heading towards our adventure. Sunglasses at the back. Just stop it. Just push it in. 